Hi campers, Garrett Cross Camping, or you may well be seeing this video through our website selfinflatedmats.co.uk and this is our top five camping pillows. So first of all we have the Van Gogh Deep Sleep Ergo pillow. What we love about this in particular, as you can see, pack size is ridiculous, so small. And this is just a, an inflatable pillow. Um, just literally a couple of breaths and it's ready. So you can have it firmer, softer, however you want. What I love about this, this, this fabric's sort of a bit stretchy. Um, and it really is super comfy. In fact, you know, all the pillows here that I've got here that I've judged as my top five uh, are really comfy. Uh, just sort of different supports. Uh, and right, so this would be ideal for the backpacker. Um, really, I say it's stretchy, so you can leave it fully inflated or let some air out. The valve works like so. Now, I'm pushing on that, no air's coming out, but you just push your finger in there and down it goes. Simple as that. And to inflate it, excuse me one second. There you go. Two, two breaths and it's up. Not a cheap pillow. Some of these pillows aren't cheap, but um, yeah, awesome, awesome bit of kit. Love it. So let's put that to one side. Uh, talking of prices, um, at the end of the video, there'll be a link at the top, top left or top right, something like that, to our uh, pillow page on selfinflatedmats.co.uk. So here is the Outwell, how do you pronounce this one, uh, uh, Nirvana, or Nirvana um, pillow. Just rolls up, it's a self-inflating pillow. Well, I say self-inflating, you probably have to blow into it. This has a very similar stretchy fabric as the Van Gogh pillow. So yeah, self-inflating, so that is expanding and filling up with air. As with all pillows, you know, you, well, with the inflatable type anyway, you, you probably think uh, you, you don't really need it fully inflated uh, to be comfortable. But this, it's, it's I don't know, it's, it's got lots of foam in there, but a lovely sort of soft feel to the top. More expensive than some of the other self-inflating pillows, uh, and certainly more expensive than one we'll show you on the last of these top five. But just has a feel for it and that's what it's all about you're talking about camp cover camp comfort aren't you so yes you can press on it let the air out get it however you want rolls up into that sort of pack size so again pretty light pretty good on a pack size um yeah nice let's move on to the outwall memory pillow which is uh always been one of my favorites um if you've had one of those sort of what do they call those wheat heat things you put around your neck i don't know it feels a bit like that it's a strange strange sort of filling uh nice sort of cottony i imagine it's a poly cotton something like that or some mega modern fabric but a real soft beautiful feel to that doesn't look that thick it really doesn't but a lot of pillows that look a lot thicker when you actually put your head on them they do uh, go down to nothing this stays really quite supportive doesn't pack up as small but and again not the cheapest of pillows but packs up reasonably well and is super comfy then old favorite of ours been supplying these for many years uh, the van gogh large square pillow nice and fleecy on one side sort of smooth poly cotton on the other side and that just rolls up into that sort of size bag um, but when you actually spread your head on there it doesn't go down too far um, again a lot of pillows do go down to nothing that still is quite supportive um, if you really must you can fold it over and it becomes really really supportive but price on these, absolutely fantastic. Um, yeah, we get through a lot of those. People love them. 
And then last but not least, the Van Gogh self-inflating pillow. Again, packs up, let's move over here a little bit, packs up reasonably small. Um, again, you open the valve and it just, let's squash some air out. But you open the valve and it just slowly self-inflates. Um, again, I don't think you'd really want to have it fully inflated. Probably around about there at the most. Maybe less, in fact. Let's get a bit of air out. There you go. And that just makes it super comfy. But a lot of filling. We've actually stocked in the past self-inflated pillows like this that have been three or four quid. Um, to be honest with you, we stocked a few. That was it. They, you know, never got them again. Uh, they were cheap. What, what can you expect? These, these are only sort of seven, eight quid, something like that. Um, at the moment really really great great value so oh, are you going to push me to say which is my top one it's difficult to say because for different sort of camping experiences that definitely the deep sleep ergo from van gogh definitely my number one for a backpacker definitely comfort wise i do do love the outwell memory pillow um it's not cheap but i love it yeah and then then there's a self-inflating one from outwell but uh, maybe if you're looking at self-inflating you could be hard pushed to beat the van Gogh. you really could and then yeah good old faithful packs up nice and small but not too dissimilar just taking your own pillow from home i suppose apart from the pack size so if you were going to push me i think i'd probably have to put number one the outwell memory pillow Number two, or number one for backpackers, definitely the Van Gogh Ergo uh, Deep Sleep. Value for money, can't go far wrong with the two Van Goghs. So that's Gary from Cross Camping Leisure, selfinflatingmats.co.uk. Remember, you can always uh, subscribe up the top there, probably top left. And uh, there's a link at the top right where you can buy these pillows. Cheers.